So I was checking out some content creators today and I came across this video that looked quite interesting based on the title. The title had two people's names in it that I'm somewhat familiar with, so I went on and watched the video. Now, person A is going through or was going through or probably still is going through a rough time, like financially. So um, no place to live. Um, they only have a vehicle. Um, they just going through a lot monetarily, right? And so person B steps in, they decided they want to help person A out. They have been helping him with food, places to sleep at times. Uh, basically, whatever person A needs, person B has decided to help, I guess, where they can, right? So I, I was under the impression that they had a really good relationship, a really good friendship. And to my surprise, I see that they are in a disgusting argument where they're both being really disrespectful towards each other. And I'm really surprised that person A, I don't know who initiated but it, initiated it, but I am really surprised that person A was speaking on person B the way that they were. Because person B, to my knowledge, I don't know the whole story, but person B was really, really good to this person, like really uh, helping person A out. He had drama with um you know other people that person b stepped in and helped with i mean person b really helped with a lot of stuff so i was just really surprised to hear just how low and disgusting person a was classifying person b nonetheless there's this beef going on things are getting heated they're doing wicked things they're saying a whole lot of wicked things and person b comes out and says that they spit and person A's water. So that means that during the friendship, you were there helping person A, right? But you were still doing underhanded, wicked, evil, conniving things to person A. If you're if you're friends with person A, what what would even possess you to think about spitting in their food or drink? What huh? Like how does that thought even come across your mind to do to anybody, let alone your own friend, that you've been backing and running to their rescue whenever they need assistance from you? So I'm looking at that like it's either one of two things. Either person B is upset at the things that person A said and they're just trying to say something low to make person A really feel some pain or anger or you know what i mean really feel something but it's not true or person b is really that low and disgusting and would do that to their own friend all while pretending that they had their back so i think what i've gathered here tonight is that your friends are sometimes really not your friends you got to be really careful who you call your friends because you might think they might just be doing stuff like talking behind your back or whatever, you know, but they could be doing things to try to compromise your health, you know, putting stuff in your food, in this case, spitting in your drink, like that is so low. Yeah. And I'm hoping that it's not true because something like that, that could make me, I'm, yeah, it, it could get real bad. It could get real bad, but that is so low, so freaking low. Comment down below and let me know what are your thoughts on this. Like, have you have you ever come across a friend that would go this far, or maybe even worse? You know, you hear things about friends sleeping with their uh, friends' partners and husbands and wives, and just disgraceful things like that. But to take your bodily fluid and put in your friends. Uh, food or drink during the friendship or even after the friendship, but period, to do it, period. Like, it's people out here really doing disgusting things like this? Because it, it's, it's hard for me to grasp. Meet me in the comments and let me know what y'all think about this whole scenario because I'm still in shock and disgust.